Hey dudes! So let's get acquainted with joining a group. Now this is pretty straightforward. Let's go to the People tab and click My Groups. If you're not already in here and go to the bottom and click Join Group. Now I should point out all this does really is just opens the Find window which you can search for stuff. So a quicker way to begin with, but I'm just showing you, hey, that's there, is to search for something, something you're interested in. Like, let's see, I like that show Fringe. I just hit enter. And when you do a search actively, you get these different tabs and the layout and stuff has been continually tweaked. So hopefully this won't be outdated too soon. Now you can click on groups. And then here we have, oh, okay, that's cool, Fringe fans. Yeah, I'm definitely a Walter Bishop fan. So you click on a group to learn more about it, see a little pretty picture, and then you can click profile and it'll pop up in the sidebar. And if you can, in fact, join the group, it will say like anyone can join. And, and then let's see here. The problem is, it's a bit confusing, is the join now button is right up there. It's a bit tricky that way. It's just emphasize that you can join. I would like to even, while I'm editorializing, I would like to be able to join a group right from here. If I could just click and join, that would be nice. But anyway, when you can join a group, it will say that otherwise it will say you have to pay a fee or you can't join if it's not open, then you will need an invite. Otherwise, you click join now and there's no risk. You can always leave it. I can just join that and we've been added. So now we're part of the fringe division. Yeah, that's an awesome show, isn't it? I wonder what's going to happen in the third season with the alternate universe. So now it's in our list of groups right here. At any time, you can right click. If you want to leave the group, then you just make sure, by the way, if you're heavily invested in a group as you get more advanced in Second Life, you may have objects on group land. Be sure loose ends are tied up. But this is just a quick join and hit and run, <laughs> join and leave demo. So we'll just leave that. And then what it also does, by the way, when you join a group, I'll just point out that it actively shows the group's title. And I covered this in another tutorial where you click a group and if you activate it like this, then it sets the title, the group title to be you. So when you newly join a group, it switches that it goes bold. If you find all the pictures distracting, you can just display group icons off. But I do like the visuals, they help. But the problem is they're often so small and the fav icon size doesn't handle things too well. Like the second life hand, that's cool, but I can't even tell that's the fringe logo for crying out loud. So anyway, I'm just gonna go and right click and just leave that group. And then we'll just exit stage left from there. But quickly, that's how to join and leave a group. So you can get started and be social. If you join a group, you may incidentally, if someone else starts a group chat, it'll appear here. That's something I should also show in more depth but now you know how to get started.